Hey everyone. So today I'm going to be talking to you about Vela lashes, which were the lashes that I used in the bridal tutorial. And people were asking and commenting and writing to me asking about the lashes and what I thought of them. So I thought I would do a video on the lashes, show you them all and talk to you about them. I've tried, I think I've tried so many lashes over the years. Um, MAC are the ones that I kind of never really get on with because they just look really fake to me. Don't know why, but I've tried a whole host. I've tried human hair, um, synthetic, you know, I've been down the range and they all, some look really good, some look great, some look horrific. And the Vela ones are made with mink hair and they're stamped as cruelty free so no minks were harmed during the processing of this video. But they look real. Even the ones that are really, really long look like real lashes and they blend and they mold with your lash and it just looks so beautiful, blown away by them. So I thought I would show you them all and as we go on, I'll talk to you. So the first ones I'm gonna deal with all the upper lashes and this one is, this one I'm not sure about the name, I think it's called T.O. Anyway, it looks like this. This is what the lash looks like. It's an incredibly full lash, but when they're molded onto your eyes, they just look like huge lashes. They don't scream fake. This next one is Day to Shine, and these are lashes with crystals attached to them, and they are incredibly pretty. Next one is Doll Me Up. This is one of my favorite ones, because I just think these are great. They're like really long, wispy lashes, and they look incredibly romantic. Uh, Striker Pose is the next ones. These are very, very sort of natural lashes. Okay, uh, these, those real, and these are very, very, again, natural lashes that most people could get away with wearing these because they just, they just, they do, they amaze me, they're so good. Naughty Me is the next section here, and very, very flirtatious, wispy, kind of blinking eyelashes. Complete Me is probably one of my favorite of all time because they just look so nice on. And these were the pair that were featured in the video to do with the bridal one. Um, these ones here, very, very full lash again, called Lash in the City. And lastly for the upper ones is Extra Oomph, which are partial lashes which go kind of on the ends of the eyes. The way you apply these is the same with most fake lashes, is that you curl your own lashes, you apply mascara, let the mascara dry, it has to dry, and then you put these lashes on because these lashes aren't cheap, they're expensive. So when you put them on, they're not gonna get gunked up with mascara, which means you can take them off and reuse them over and over and over again. So they don't become this horrendously expensive thing because you can reuse these. Um, okay, this is the lower lashes. First sight. And these are for the lower lashes, and I'm going to show you my favorite in a second. These look so nice on the lower lash, and they're featured in a video that's coming up soon, so you'll see. But this is my favorite pair, which is Kardashian. These are lower lashes, and when combined with the set that I like called Complete Me, just looks amazing. Yes, they're expensive. They are more expensive than your general lashes are that you would go and buy in town. But again, you can reuse these, and because they give a natural effect to the eye, which is why I like them. A lot of time with things with me, when the price starts to creep up, I think, oh, I... But this time, it's something that I... Well, I like it. I think they look great. They look amazing on brides. They look amazing in photos, because they look real. And that's all you can ask for when you're looking at fake lashes. Um, invest in a set, look after them. You can pick the glue off the ends. It's perfectly fine you can reuse them. The site says 25 times. I think you can get away with a lot more than that, but just take care of them. Thank you. Bye.